So next up, we've got the French press, and we're gonna do a seated variation. Uh, you can do this standing, but just know that when you are standing, you may get some lumbar compensation. Now, it's not gonna be unsafe or anything like that. It's just gonna sort of give you a pseudo range of motion that you may not necessarily have. So when you take a seat on the bench, you take a dumbbell up in the diamond, overhead. So this is gonna be a bit of a passive range, but also a tricep volume drill as well. So you can start to develop some blood getting through the triceps. So going overhead already, you can see that he's gonna be forcing himself into more range of motion through the shoulder joint and the thoracic range. And then by allowing that dumbbell to come down as far as he can, you can see that now we're getting a bit of a structural stretch across the elbow joint and across the shoulder joint as well. So sometimes we just chill out there for a little bit. Obviously the heavier it is, the more it's gonna pull you down. We're trying to keep our elbows tucked in and then we can actually start to press. So we can do a combination of isometric holds as well as doing some repetitions. Uh, they're both gonna be effective, so just play around with the two together. Aiming to keep the ribs tucked down towards the hips so that we don't find ourselves compensating and get some more reins that we don't actually have.